The government is moving fast towards tightening the rules to curb the use of cash in the budget. Finance Minister Remember Arun Jaitley had proposed to ban all cash transactions beyond 3 lakh rupees. But today, the centre has moved an amendment to the finance bill seeking to lower that further to just 2 lakh rupees. Tim C. Jaipuria joins in with all the details. So, Tim C., take us through this proposal because the 3 lakh uh, uh, sort of cap on cash transactions was in line with the recommendations that the SIT Committee on Black Money had proposed. Now the government wants to bring it down to 2 lakh. And also, what were, because we understand there were some other important proposals also as part of the finance bill like Aadhaar, Usage and Panka. Take us through all the details, Tim C. Very true, as you cited, uh, SIT had recommended that cash transactions beyond 3 lakh rupees should be banned and should be termed as illegal, as they say. But now in the amendments today, which have been moved in the parliament, that is the amendment to the finance bill, the government has proposed to lower down the limit to 2 lakh rupees. Very clearly a, a direction that has come from the top uh, from the top officials that is the highest political level that any cash transaction beyond 2 lakh rupees should be banned and should be termed as illegal now this tightening has been done to keep only uh, in one thing in mind that is to curb black money and allowing and not keep making people to hold cash as such very clearly on the other amendments the, uh, there are other amendments also which have been moved in the finance bill today which empower uh, the tax department now what they want is that aadhar should be made uh, compulsory till now I, in the itr form the aadhar was an optional window and now it is a compulsory that is mandatory window if you do not fill your aadhar number your itr return cannot be submitted similarly while applying for a new pan you need to see you need to cite your Aadhaar and in case you have applied for Aadhaar and you have not been allocated a number then you need to give your Aadhaar enrollment application number in that thing very clearly uh, it's it's a clear tool that Aadhaar they would now want to see Aadhaar in each and every bank account and each and every PAN application and ITR form so that the, because there are cases of duplicate PANs that thing gets eradicated and one Aadhaar and one PAN is the clear idea now and they want ITR returns to be seen did with your Aadhaar and PAN. So very okay. clearly black money is on the agenda and government is doing every bit to curb black money.